The serology test is important in the contact tracing and um, looking back of who infected who and linking all these clusters together. We were prepared to do test development as soon as we knew that there was an outbreak. So as soon as the sequence of the virus was released, we made pieces of the virus. So this is all non-infectious work without using the actual virus and then worked to uh, develop that test. The serology test is something that we use in the lab to detect antibodies. What happens when you're sick or when you get infected with a virus or a bacteria, your body makes these antibodies. So uh, the test is something that we can use to determine if you've been sick. How it works is we take sera from the patient, so that's part of the patient's blood, and then we mix that in a, a well and then the antibodies from the patient, if they're in there, they stick onto the pieces of the virus and then it, we can detect it using that test. So this test takes uh, probably about half a day. So we can have, if we get the blood in the morning, we can have an answer by lunchtime. This is important and long-term for everybody, not only in Singapore, but worldwide. When we have a vaccine, we want to see if the vaccine actually works. So we give the people the vaccine, but we want to make sure that you develop antibodies against the virus as induced by that vaccine. So this is precisely how we will monitor how uh, people, if the vaccine is working in people. I would like to highlight, highlight NCID. The people there are amazing and I, I had a chance to work very closely with them and these are the people on the ground that are handing us the samples. So they're, as a, personally, these are the people that I see directly. And we're all working day and night. Like, we don't see our friends, we don't see our family, and so we get to know each other as a family instead. To see how all the different institutes and organisations in Singapore really have worked together to this, um, to try to help everybody.